Hello friends. Welcome to SV Union High School and Junior College Pune. Standard 8 Mathematics. Chapter 6 Factorization of Algebraic Expressions. Let's start with rational algebraic expressions. factorization of algebraic expressions today we are going to learn about rational algebraic expressions you have already learned about rational numbers isn't it the rational numbers are in the form of m upon n that is in the form of numerator and denominator let us now see what is a rational algebraic expression If a and b are two algebraic expressions, then a upon b is called as a rational algebraic expression. Okay. Now, when we are going to simplify these rational algebraic expressions, we are going to perform various operations like addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division, so as to simplify them. As we use to perform on rational numbers. Okay, so we are going to uh, see and simplify the rational algebraic expressions. But before that, we need to recall all the algebraic formulae we learned. Okay, let us see. You have already learned a plus b the whole square is equal to a square plus two ab plus b square. a minus b the whole square is equal to a square minus 2ab plus b square again we have learned a plus b the whole cube is equal to a cube plus 3a square b plus 3ab square plus b cube another formula we have learned a minus b the whole cube is equal to a cube minus 3a square b plus 3ab square plus b cube You have also learned the factors of a cube plus b cube is equal to a plus b into a square minus a b plus b square, as well as a cube minus b cube is equal to a a minus b into a square plus a b plus b square. You have also learned that a square minus b square is equal to a plus b into a minus b. And also one more formula, which is a plus b plus c the whole square is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus 2ab plus 2bc plus 2ac. So, so many algebraic formulae you have learned. You have learned their factors, and you have also simplified. You have also factorized the quadratic trinomials. right various algebraic expressions so let us start with simplifying the rational algebraic expressions so remember if two algebraic expressions a and b are given then a upon b is called as rational algebraic expression remember one more point the denominators or the divisors of these rational expressions are non zero okay so let us start with few examples and simplify certain algebraic expressions and we are going to simplify this rational algebraic expression which is in the form of a upon b got it all of you so here we have We have learned a few of uh, expansion formulae as well as uh, factorize to factorize the the quadratic trinomials, the binomials, and the monomials. You have learned how to factorize them and how to learn them in earlier videos and in earlier practice sets of this chapter. So we are going to simplify this particular rational algebraic expression using those. Formula, algebraic formula, which we have learned earlier, right? So let us start simplifying this rational algebraic expression. Let me start with the numerator one, 
which is x square minus 9y square. So x square minus 9y square. Do you remember that we have learned an expansion formula of a square minus b square is equal to a plus b into a minus b, which are of course the factors also. So here x square minus 9y square is in the form of a square minus b square. Of course there is a coefficient uh, number so we have to think about it. Okay, right. So can I uh, convert this uh, expression in the form of a square minus b square? Yes, a square minus b square is a plus b into a minus b. So using this formula let me uh, factorize x square minus 9y square is equal to can be converted into x the whole square first so that I can get a the whole square minus sign as it is. Now here it is 9 I know the square root of 9 is 3 so I am going to use 3 here 3 y is the variable that is given so 3 y the whole square. Now I have converted the given as the expression into a square minus b square form, right? So a square minus b square is a plus, a plus b into a minus b. So here it is equal to x plus 3y into x minus 3y. After substituting for a and for b, I have got the factors. Okay, for x square minus 9y square. So let me check out the second expression here which is in the denominator now. Um, it is given x cube minus 27y cube. Now here this x cube minus 27y cube is in the form of a cube minus b cube and we have already learned to factorize and we have found the factors of a cube minus b cube. I know it is a minus b into a square plus a b plus b Right? So using this formula, let me factorize x cube minus 27y cube is equal to directly, I can't include because I can't use directly this formula because I have to find a as well as b here for this uh, factor. That is why I have been converting the expression into a x the whole cube minus now I have to find out the cube root of 27 which is 3. 3 3 is a 9, 9 3 is a 27. So instead of 27 I can write it as 3 cube. Okay. So it is 3. Of course there is a variable y. So 3y the whole cube. Now I have the, the form, the expression in the form of a cube minus b cube. Now I can convert using the uh, substituting for a and b as x and y. Okay, I can write now x minus 3y into x square plus a b substitute for a is x into b is 3y. Right? Plus b square is 3y the whole square. Now let me simplify this. x minus 3y into x square plus 3y. 3 into xy is 3xy or x into 3y is 3xy plus 3y the whole square is 3 3 is a 9, 9 and y divided by y square so 9y square. You have, we have already factorized such algebraic expressions earlier in the other practice sets and so I have directly, I have done this directly so now I have converted the algebraic expression x square minus y square is equal to x plus 3y into x minus 3y and x cube minus 27y cube as x minus 3y and x square plus 3xy plus 9y square. Now I am going to substitute um, the expressions with their factors. So that is equal to let me write x square minus 9y square is x plus 3y into x minus 3y upon x cube minus 27y cube is here 3 sorry x minus 3y into x square plus
plus 3xy plus 9y squared. Got it all of you? So here you have the factors of the given algebraic expressions. Now I can simplify further. I know it is in the numerator and denominator form. So the similar terms can be cancelled here. Here I have 3 plus xy. But I don't have 3 plus xy here. But 3 minus xy. I have a term 3 minus xy. 3 bar. So x minus 3 bar. So x minus 3y and x minus 3y can be cancelled. Now here there is another term x square plus 3xy plus 9y square in the denominator. But the single term is absent over here. The same way x plus 3y uh, is, a, is a term in the numerator but I don't have any other term. Like term in the denominator. So I cannot simplify further. So it will be x plus 3y upon x square plus 3xy plus 9y square, right? So, therefore, I have simplified the expression x square minus 9y square upon x cube minus 27y cube into x uh, is equal to x plus 3y upon x square plus 3xy plus 9y square. Remember students, when there is a multiplication sign between two terms, you can cancel the numerator and denominator like terms and then, is that clear? So here I have x plus 3y upon x square plus 3xy upon plus 9y square as my answer. Thank you.